a methodical leader, loving father and husband, a true friend and reformist. This is how friends and family members describe former speaker Prospero Nograles as house members and employees honored and welcome him again to his second home at the House of Representatives on Tuesday morning. A mass was held in honor of the 71-year-old veteran lawmaker who succumbed to respiratory failure secondary to pneumonia last Saturday, May 4. During the necrological services, Retired Secretary General Marilyn Yap recounted the reforms and legacies of Nograles as Speaker from 2008 to 2010. Speaker Gloria Macapagal Arroyo also recalled how Nograles helped create a wonderful world with his friendships and his work. And what I would like to tell boy today is, yes boy, what a wonderful world you helped to create with your friendship, with your work. Nograles' son, PBA Representative Jericho Nograles, also thanked his father for cleaning the House of Representatives and ridding it of close employees. When I came back as a member of Congress in this 17th Congress, I told myself the Congress looks better. Thank you for keeping the house clean. That was the project of my mom. And thank you for keeping the house professional. Nograles was survived by his wife, Rodora, and their four children, Christine, Cabinet Secretary Carlo Nograles, Jericho, and Margarita. His remains will be flown to Davao later Tuesday and will be laid to rest in his hometown, Davao City, this coming Sunday. This is Patricia Rojas for Inquirer.net.